Hey guys, welcome back. It's the Can You Chronicles, and I'm just gonna continue on giving you an update on the Steelers. Uh, week two aftermath. It is Monday evening. A lot's happened in the last 24 hours. Unfortunately, we lost uh, Big Ben. It looks like for the season they're saying due to uh, elbow surgery that's gonna be needed. Uh, we don't know how extensive, but it uh, hasn't looked good. It wasn't a contact injury. Uh, a lot of people were thinking it looks like a Tommy John's type surgery. But first, please like and subscribe. Please, I appreciate that. Also, if you want to hear more, I have a podcast if you didn't know. It's always streaming, um, brand new every Tuesday, sometimes even a little earlier. And you can check it out here. So, anyways, um, back to the QB situation Steelers Mason Rudolph looks like he will be the starter for sure he will be the starter coming up uh, matter of how long this season looks like the whole season but hey you never know um, also some other moves Steelers just signed uh, My Minica Fitzpatrick I might be saying it wrong from the Dolphins uh, they're giving up a first round pick for him but I guess he was a first rounder himself maybe I think he's a cornerback, if I'm not mistaken. So they say that defense Steelers now have eight number one picks. So let's see what we can do. We got some major guys locked in now for the next three years, it looks like, including this guy. Um, it's funny because it looks pretty split. I see people excited. I see people not so excited. But either way, Steelers are making moves, and they're not slowing down and giving up this year so let's see what we can do go Steelers heading into week three